Hi everyone, this is Kamal. Welcome back to the official channel of Video Park Vlogger. New series of Video Park Official Guide are available in the channel, and you can find a complete set of videos showing you how to use Video Park Vlogger to create stunning videos from scratch. Before we dive into the journey, make sure you check out the link in the description box below to download the software for free. Many travel videos on video sharing platforms look amazing with beautiful and bright colors. However, the color of our own videos usually look a bit washed out. Well, actually, you just need to apply 3D law to get your video a perfect new look. Many experienced filmmakers use stylish 3D LUTs to color grade their footage, but that doesn't mean using LUTs is anything tricky. On the contrary, even a beginner can quickly master 3D LUTs and enjoy its conveniences. Now, let me show you how to apply 3D LUTs to your footage in just one click with VideoProc Blogger. Take a double click to open up the software. Click on there, import your video clips. Drag the video clips onto the timeline track. Select your video clip and then choose color button under the preview window to enter the color editor panel. Have you noticed the left panel? Well, you can find all preset 3D lots of video product flagger over here. Select the proper one and hit apply. That lot is already applied to your video clip. Super handy, isn't it? Now, I'm gonna give you a brief introduction about the other basics about how to use 3D LUTs. The 71 3D LUTs in Video Proc Flagger are organized into three categories lifestyle, portrait, and landscape. You can choose the right LUT based on the application scenarios, like this or this. Or you can choose a 3D lot based on the mood of the film, just like this. With thumbnails, you can quickly figure out how these 3D lots look like. Surely, taking a click is how I check a 3D lot most often. This can help me find how it looks like on a video. After clicking the 3D LUT effect, you can come over to the preview window in the middle to preview the video with LUT in real time. Click the Show Source screen button. It is pulling the picture before adding the 3D LUT. You can click here to easily see the changes given by the 3D LUT. If you want to preview the video, you can click on the buttons under the preview window. Here, you can play or pause the playback, as well as stop or preview the video frame by frame. On the right properties panel, drag the slider here. You can adjust the intensity of the 3D LUT. Have a try moving the slider to get a perfect color grading result. A note of caution, we have selected a 3D LUT effect, and then you keep selecting another one. The new one won't merge with the previous. Instead, it removes the previous one once we apply the new. When we come across the loved 3D LUT, we can click on the herd icon to add that to the favorite list. So when we want to apply it next time, we can quickly X that in this list. Or we can check all the 3D LUTs we love on the favorite list. Just like what we do before, click on a button, we can apply that 3D LUT. Apart from that, suppose you have your own 3D LUT files. You can click on the plus button on the left bottom to add a lot to video product flagger manually, just like this. 
the imported 3D LUTs will display at the bottom of the current list. For example, the 3D LUTs I add to the lifestyle list display here rather than a lifestyle list. When you finish all the adjustments, don't forget to hit apply to apply the changes. Alright, now you reached this video about 3D LUTs in Video Park Flagger. If you want to learn more editing skills about color, I've made a tutorial about that. Just click here to have a watch. Don't forget to click the subscribe button to subscribe if you haven't yet. We will see you in our next Sky tutorial. Hope you enjoy. Bye.